Good morning, everyone. Happy Monday morning. It's not all that happy. I'm not crying. I just put in my contacts, so um, my eyes are wet. But uh, it's the first day back after spring break, and it just... I don't know if there's a better word to describe the feeling than it just sucks. <laughs> it sucks to get back up early again and all that. Um, it's kind of nice to get the kids out of the house, I will say. Um, just for a little bit, I guess. And... Um, Today actually wasn't so bad. I feel like it's always hardest to wake up the second day back from a from a break in routine because today your kind of adrenaline gets you up. You're worried if the alarm will go off and all that. And then the next day you're just, you're tired. So anyway, I thought I would hop on and show you what I'm doing to my face this morning. I'm going to be washing it with my Colleen Rothschild Balancing Gel Cleanser. I love this stuff. It just wakes me up in the morning. Then I've added a couple new things. Um, in the mornings, I am using the Clinique Mild Clarifying Lotion. It's not a lotion. Hear that? It's a gel. Or not a gel. It's a liquid. It's it's liquid. And it's salicylic acid. It's a mild exfoliating toner. And I've only been using this for a handful of days. So I have no... All I can say is I've had no reaction. No negative reaction. So that's good. And then I have been using... This is my... Sorry. This is the medicine cabinet. It's just crazy. There is a lot of stuff in there. So I think what I've lately been doing, not lately, for about a month, two months now. Wow. Um, I wonder how much is left in this. I will say that's part of, I love this, but my only complaint is I have no idea how much is in here and when I need to order a backup. But in the mornings, I use my Clinique Even Better Clinical Dark Spot Corrector. I put the, and they did give that to me. Didn't pay for this either. This is the dark eyes thing also. Um, I love this. It has a slight tint to it. I feel like it really, I don't know, I don't really have bad dark circles, so I couldn't tell if it's working or not, but I do notice that my eyes look brighter on the days when I wear this. Then in the mornings, I use this eye cream. This is the Clinique All About Eyes eye cream. It's a lot lighter than my mega favorite, the Colleen Rothschild one. Look at that. I am like literally scraping the bottom. Um, this is what I use at night, and I have a backup in my other cabinet. And then um, I will mist my face with this moisture surge spray. I really like this as well. And then when I'm actually ready to um, put my makeup on, this is in front of my makeup mirror. It's the Sheer Renewal Cream. And I've ordered sunscreen from Colleen Rothschild because I'm going to use that as, I used to just use a moisturizer that had the sunscreen in it, but I'm going to try and do better this year, and I'm going to put a layer of sunscreen on first, and then put on my moisturizer. And I have used a gajillion, that's an official word, Colleen Rothschild products, then they don't irritate my skin, so I feel like that's a safe one to try, is, is her sunscreen because I know I haven't reacted negatively to any of her other products so that's what I'm doing and that's a lot of chatter about washing my face so I'm going to actually stop talking about it and do it. Hey guys sorry it's a little dim in here I like it that way when I'm sitting at my desk. I've spent most of the morning doing a YouTube Creator Academy boot camp and I got a letter of completion. Um, every once in a while they offer these kind of cool classes for YouTubers, YouTube creators, that's what I am. I am not a guru. I don't know who came up with that term, but that is, doesn't fit me. Anyway, um, so every once in a while they offer these free classes online to teach you how to use YouTube better or interact with just all kinds of little tips. So this one I really like because it's about how to engage my subscribers and viewers and, um, ways to use social media to interact with you, making sure I know how to navigate all the little tools and trips and ticks, trips, oh my goodness, tricks and tips on Google Plus and all this stuff. So I, um, one of the neat things that they talked about was doing a Google Plus circle of your top 500 viewers, meaning the 500 viewers that interact with you the most, that leave the most comments on videos and things like that. So I set that circle up, um, and then there are ways to like um, just upload private videos just for that group and things like that, and um, sort of as a thank you, because they've spent so much time watching me and helping my channel, why not spend a little time saying hey and setting up 
video chats and all that. So I used to do video chats a long time ago. I stopped doing them. It was, I can't even remember the, it was before Google Plus came out. So I'm gonna, I think I'm gonna try adding one or one a month maybe. And uh, so I will schedule it. So I'll put up a video ahead of time letting y'all know when that's going to happen so we can interact live. And it'll probably be full of technical difficulties, but I think it's worth a shot. It's just, a, for me, it's a very fulfilling way of actually, if not seeing you face to face, at least interacting with you in real time. So I've been playing with that and I'm still working on that. And that's going to take up most of the morning as I wait for my... Um, air conditioner guy to show up. He's scheduled between 11 and 1, 11 and 2. It's a big window, so I'm just hanging out. We're 15 minutes in. Hey guys, it's been an incredibly slow day. I haven't left the house except to walk to the garage. Um, I spent all day, I, I, I should know better when I'm scheduling maintenance people to come to the house, not to schedule a window that's smack dab in the middle of the day because basically it sucked up the whole day and I felt like I couldn't get anything done waiting for them to come. And then once the air conditioning guys were here, it's a few hour visit, I have two units, and so it takes a while. Um, and I don't wanna rush them, I mean, I wanna make sure my units are working, but um, you, I can't. I feel like I can't start a project, there's people in the house, I can't. long story short, didn't leave the house, didn't get anything done that I expected to get done except laundry. Finished putting that away, woo -hoo. Uh, And a couple packages came, so I wanna show you what showed up. Um, that's an interesting, I did not stage that. That looks nice though, doesn't it? All this stuff. Uh, I had ordered the Colleen Childs, Colleen Child, I can't talk. It's clearly Monday and the first day back from vacation. The Colleen Rothschild Daily Defense Broad Spectrum SPF 25. I haven't opened it yet. I don't know how you, do you just squeeze it? It's kind of squishy, the tube. Yes, you just squeeze it out. Okay, and then they gave me this. Thank you, Colleen. This is their new Adrian Newell Super Serum. It's supposed to do a lot of amazing things. I haven't read about it or anything, but I will give this a go and let you know how that turns out. I had ordered this skirt from Loft a while, uh, a week ago. And I think it's really cute. And I was trying to get a shirt that matched it exactly because I kind of want like an all like one color thing. I think it's very slimming and cute. Look, it has pockets. I love skirts that have pockets. And I ordered this from Loft, and this is very cute. Obviously, I'm gonna need a cami under it. Um, it doesn't feel itchy, but look, and I know the lighting in my bathroom is not lovely, and my arm's not long enough to get you a good picture here, but that doesn't go either. So I'm keeping this. I think it's cute, but I just don't think it's gonna go with that. It will go with the other thing I ordered, which I already put away, it's just a pair of white, um, they're actually exactly like these. These are also from Loft, but they're white, white skinny stretchy jeans for the summer, spring, what have you. And the reason I haven't done a organization tour is because this is the mess of my closet. And I just have been shoving things in there, you caught me. And I kind of have my jewelry arranged. There are the jeans. Actually, I didn't put them away. Nice job, Marn. These are the jeans. They're not all that exciting. They're just white jeans. Anyway, it's kind of a mess. It's a little bit of a mess. And then there's more jewelry in these boxes. So anyway. Oh, and there's more necklaces over there. That's why I haven't done how to organize your jewelry because somebody needs to organize their jewelry before I tell you how to organize your jewelry. That'd be a little bit of the pot calling the kettle black or the blind leading the blind or some sort of cliche that I can't think of right now. Anyway, I'm going to be the mom of the year and order pizza for the kids for dinner because my husband is in LA, or where is he? Orange County, the Orange County office today, and he's getting home really late, and so I don't want to make dinner for everybody. And Domino's is having half off specials, so it's sort of like a consolation prize. Sorry you had to go to school and wake up at six o'clock in the morning, but here's pizza for dinner. So it's a win-win, right? So I'm gonna cut the vlog short here. I know that my vlogs have been getting progressively shorter. I am not doing that on purpose. I just don't see the point in vlogging nothing. Like today has been a day of nothing. And I just, empty space to me, I'm just not gonna talk just to fill up time or film, I don't know, paint drying just to fill up time. So I'm trying to make these meaningful vlogs. Today was not so much, but 
there was a lot of talking, not a lot of action. Hopefully tomorrow will be more interesting. So I shall see you then. Thank you for watching. We're halfway through the month of Marnie's March Mayhem. I would have called it March Madness, but there's some trademark issues. So thanks for sticking around through half of this and I'll see you for the other half. All right, you know what? I can't believe I'm saying this. It's freaking hot. I'm going in the house. Good girl. Good Mimi girl.